Hey, this is David Jr. with Santa Fe Archery. The tip of the week this week is going to be over setting up a bow fishing reel uh, on a bare bow or a long bow, traditional bow, uh, a recurve bow, and how the placement of the arrow should be. So first of all, if you're going to set this up on a long bow that doesn't have a bushing, then we have this. It's made by AMS, and it'll accept the reel seat, which is right here, this, the green thing. And what you do is you can put that on your bow and screw that in and then you can have a fishing reel on your bow. Now I had one made for myself because we live in a salt water area and it's, everything is really humid and salty down here. What you'll do is you'll take and you'll place the rubber backing against the riser and having it firmly seated. Take the rubber and you'll wrap it around snugly around the riser of the bow, the limb of the bow. You give it two or three wraps, and you'll see that it has holes in it where you can put it over the peg. Then you pull it tight and lock the top and the bottom in. Now I'll do the same thing to the top. Give it a few wraps. Then secure it on the pen. Then all you need to do is take your line out, secure it to your arrow. And in this case, this arrow, you'll notice it has a stopper on the end. So when the, when the slide comes back, it hits the stopper, which allows you to draw in your fish. And once you have it tied off, the way you want to position this is to where the stopper is up. You don't want your stopper coming across your rest and tearing your, your rest seat up. So this will be up or preferably out to the side a bit so it doesn't catch on the side of your shelf either. Now you can do the same thing with the reel seat on a recurve bow without actually having to, to use the, the modified rubber stopper and screwing it into an exterior portion of the bow. It'll go right into the bushing where the stabilizer would normally mount. And it's the exact same thing that you had with your longbow. And you may have to make a little adjustment here and there to make sure it gets, goes on straight. But that's what the, it has a nut on there for and you can tighten it down. Once you get it on, you screw it in. Make sure it's secure. And then you can tighten your nut down. Get your reel set up straight, right or left hand depending. Then you secure the nut. And you're ready to go fishing again. And those are the two ways you can put them onto a recurve bow or traditional bow. And then this year they also came out with the AMS Swamp Thing. Uh, it's a 40 to 50 pound bow, dual cams. Uh, it's it's uh, ideal for your uh, all types of bow fishing. So it has AMS reel on it. So it's easy to set up, easy to retrieve, easy to cast. This is David Lenning with Santa Fe Archery. This is your tip of the week. Stay with us. We'll keep you pumping blood.